The Swans remain clear on top of the ladder. We saw the third draw of the season. GWS leave the Cats licking their wounds after a fourth straight loss. The Tigers get their all back, but not the points in the Dreamtime game as the Bombers consolidate second place on the ladder and is Brisbane season over after the Hawks hand them another loss. All that and more in this episode of Ankle Saw. Hello and welcome to another episode of Ankle Saw and our review of Round 11. If you're enjoying our channel as much as we enjoy making videos, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. It really helps us out. Also, go ahead and hit the bell icon to alert you. You just never know when we might do a surprise live stream or an emergency True. club corner. Boys, how are we? Fantastic, yeah. Angel. Fantastic. Very, very nicely. Going very nicely. nice. Been very going nice. nicely. Thank Enjoyed you. a little bit of footy on the weekend. Or? Yeah, yeah. yeah a little, little bit of uh, strain rules. Weather's closing in. Fog. Typical yeah. freezing, mate. The morning's maze. been cold, it's mate. Cold, yeah. yeah. So let's get into the first game of round 11, Thursday night at Marvel Stadium. Western Bulldogs 12-16-88. Sydney Swans 16-6-102. 14 point margin. Correct. Andrew. Very lucky, the Swans, I thought. I was, yeah. In the end, I thought, I, yeah, you're right. So if Norton doesn't go down and Ralph Mouth doesn't go down, <clears throat> he was the best player. That Ralph he was, was, Ed Richards. Was that your yeah. call on the text or was He's that yours? Ed Richards, everyone. I thought it was yours. Ralph no, Mouth is Ralph Mouth. Ed Richards. And I've got another one for you. Yeah. Nick Blakey yeah. looks like Dale Lewis oh, yeah. from the Swans. Slightly. Yeah, slightly. I can see Put that. Put up the footy car and we'll see. Yeah, maybe get, yeah, you need the footy car. They look exactly like each he's other. He's got the frill neck hairstyle. Like yeah, he's just he's got, the old, he's got the old flick. Left footer, yeah. yeah he's, he's got just, the flick. Yeah. He's got the flick going with the, um, with the crimper. <laughs> he's the crimper. Jeez. That's going back. The hot crimper yeah, melting thought, on the bathroom. <laughs> I thought the bench were... on the laminate. Jeez, I never had the crimper. Anyway, I thought they were a bit no lucky. Hair. You don't need to That's crimp. true. They were a bit lucky, Sydney. Um, yeah, another two or three minutes, and dogs win by a couple. Uh, Suffice Ralph Melf and um, Norton, Norton, Norton not yeah. playing. At the end of the day, yeah, two, they, they two nearly less, ran them yeah, over. Like another that's, two or three minutes, and the dogs yeah. win. And I know it doesn't, we always say this, but 28 shots for goal, they, they butchered a few. Yeah, yeah, the kicking, yeah. kicking goal is horrendous. Yeah, they did. The Look, dogs. I said Sydney would win comfortably, and you, you, I think you said maybe the dogs. Yeah, I said the dogs would win, and, and I would have liked to have seen them with um, Ralph Melf and. Ed Richards and um, Aaron Norton. <laughs> but they, like got, a, they got a hold of him in the third quarter. They, they did. Well, they really got a hold of him. And, but but they toyed went off with the him first a little minute, bit, like, didn't they? But Sydney just clean. Like, look, yeah. look at their goal kicking, 16-6. They just, yeah. Everything they do is just polished. How good was Goulden again? Uh, yeah. And Warner. Did you see Warner. that goalie Warner's kick? Game. On the opposite, he was on the wrong side yeah. of his body. He's just he's a genius. Oh, they're clean, Sydney. Heaney, but... Heaney was good again. But you guys don't like McDonald. Both of nah, you. I'm not a big I'm not, fan. Not a fan of McDonald. He might come good. I don't know, but at the moment, right now, doesn't mm. look for me. He, he's their their forward line. Like those three tools are definitely their downfall. Sydney. Oh, I'll say one thing about yeah, Sydney. Well, I had a goals. Yeah, go. You go. Sorry, I was going to say one. You're right because if it wasn't, for, I think if they, if they didn't have such good midfield kicking, kicking goals, yeah, yeah, well, they'd be in a bit I'm of a trouble. Big yeah. knocker on a Marty. Big knocker. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. They're all like can't kick. Yeah, yeah it's it looks a bit of, like he's laconic and. You're right. Both of those forwards look too. Do you know he's not bad when he goes forward? And no one ever talks about him. McLean. He's actually all right. He's handy. Good he's hands. Okay. He's, he's very handy. Forward, saying he's handy. Yeah, he kicks goals. Okay, yeah. He is. He is. Yeah, McDonald. Yeah. You can't depend on him. He's got that ugly kicking the motion. He's got a bad know. kicking style. Yeah, I don't know. But anyway, look, they were lucky. But fair enough. They got, yeah, the, points, got, got the points. They, they, and they just know to win. Yeah, they do. Sitting pretty on top of the ladder. Yeah. Yeah, and they probably won't lose top spot. It's a long way to go. Long way to go. Three three months of footy. Long way to go. Friday night at Optus Stadium, Fremantle 11 9 75. Drew with Collingwood 10 15 75. Vito, you can have that one. He's, he's right, Collingwood. I'll fit your pair all day. We do. Oh, Freo will win. No problem. Well, Collingwood's out, this and that. And again, they didn't win, granted. Mm. But again, they had that game. They did. Kicked 10 15 and probably should have won. Didn't. 24 mm. points up at one stage. Yeah, didn't. And good luck to Fremantle for coming back. But how do you ride Collingwood off every week? Um, if because they keep dropping pressure like they did in that last 25 minutes, I'll write them off every week. There was zero pressure. I just don't zero like that. I think they ran out well, They lost Mychak during the course of the game, yeah, and it was the help, other injury. Yeah. They uh, lost two. Mason else. Cox. Mason, Mason Cox. Cox. Got doesn't matter. Knee snapped. Yeah. Was See that, that the most horrendous thing? Yeah. He was like Bruce Reed. <laughs> he was yeah, like Bruce Reed. almost snapped in half. <laughs> it was horrendous. It was bad. That yeah, was that's bad. So he's done. But um, 
Yeah, look, I don't know what to say about Frio. They're on ballers. Come on, give them something, boys. No, no, they're on ballers. They're on ballers. We've spoken about Sarong and Brayshaw. Yeah, They've yeah, got a good on ball brigade, no doubt. Yeah. But that, I don't like that loose half off half back. Cox. Same, yeah, not Cox. Ryan, Ryan sorry. Ryan, yeah. yeah, look, oh, I thought they were lucky for Frio. Good, good luck to him coming back. They didn't throw him in the towel. I know you hate Pierce, but he's just a beauty. Is it you end, that Pierce. doesn't like him? The defender. Oh, no, I didn't say anything. a beauty at the end. A beauty. Under, yeah. under pressure. Yeah, yeah, it's good. He's actually a good player, right? Mm. I thought they were lucky. Because, look, they came back from four goals down and mm. good luck to him, but I thought Collingwood in control all night. He probably should have won. And in the end, Sharp should have kicked that goal. Probably should have. Probably yeah. should have won the game. Like it was, yeah. yeah, it was 30 metres out on the run. I oh, know there was pressure. Mm. Probably if, look, okay, let's stupid. Fair probably, result. Fair, yeah, probably. Let's talk about that free kick. Yeah, no problem. It's in the rules. Yeah, you, you've I agree. got to give it back to it's the other I don't understand what the who goes about. There's a lot of people jumping up and down. I just don't. You're right, but I a think, bit of common sense. I don't think he meant it. Like I understand if you're doing it to waste time. I think he just thought, just yeah, I don't know. He was getting up and he gave it to you, and you're the umpire, like, yeah, mate, mate. like just, and then yeah. you just give the footy. Like it's not like the player dropped the. Footy I know and it's ran the off. rules. Yeah. I know it's the rules. Yeah, but that's sometimes you got to use a bit of common sense. Yeah, I agree. Now, I agree. Yeah, you know what? Was, just ball it up. Also, it like um. Last week, oh, God, what happened to Goldstein like. and Davies Uniac, believe it or not. Same thing. Same it? thing. Okay. Same thing. Remember. Right on the bounce. The bounce of the game. There was a free kick. Right oh, on the bounce. Yeah, they got 50 straight away. It was because of that. Give but me a spell. The umpires are saying the following morning, I think it was Tom Brown or one of those. It's Tom Brown. Like, he doesn't work what? anymore. Oh, doesn't well, he? Whoever it was. What is that? He's, he's gone. He's finished. Ch- what, what is, is he Tom do? Brown, Channel 7. He retired. When? Well, oh, he moves on to bigger and better things. Yeah, I don't know Has what he? he's doing. I've never... Well, yeah. News to me. He's, anyway, it doesn't yeah. matter. Whoever it was. S- yeah. Mentioned how the umpires were really annoyed with Collingwood throughout the course of the night. Why? Uh, just being slow play, doing it yeah. at contests, getting up on stoppages. Okay. And so and at one stage, that one of the umpires was telling Steel Sidebottom like three or four times, the ball, the ball, give us the ball, Steel, Steel. Mm. So that, they did... Get a warning. Oh, I remember that. You just left it on the so ground. So you're saying and because they lost it. a couple of plays, a couple of um, rotations, yeah, they probably, time. yeah, probably, yeah, probably get, get their breath back and, and whatever. Probably, yeah, that's exactly smart. Right. Probably but, smart, but at the same time, probably is it in the, is it in the, um, you know, doesn't matter, mate. If you you got to try and win games, it's that close. I agree. Like, it's oh, a, a that's right. But I thought that was a harsh every... decision. It, I know it's in the it's in the rule book. I get all that. But, but come on. But fair in the end, like it wasn't like it was some one there the blue. Anyway. Imagine the free, free man to the coach, a proper coach. <laughs> no, just imagine. You, you Be- because because seriously, any coach in the AFL who thinks that Sean Darcy is an AFL footballer, right, when you've got a gem cold in the forward line, Luke Jackson, he, is he goes the, into yeah. the ruck, they win that game. They've got nothing else in the forward line. Yeah, but he's their best ruckman too. But he's their oh, best ruckman and can reckon? go forward and kick goals. Instead of him just going there, I'm not getting a touch. I'm not getting a touch. But they've got that slob. He's a slob, Sean Darcy. He's not built. He's not no exactly way. No, nah, he looks like someone I'd see watching my niece play soccer in the crowd there. Mate, he, he's, he's <laughs> a shocking footballer. I'm going to say it. He's shocking. And as for Nathan Fife. be a man Jeez, and end back. it. No, nah, no. Nah. Mate, did you see can the I, other can night? Can I knock a player? Is he done you can knock. Oh, Lockie Shields. Had a shocker. Yeah, he's a tubby yeah, little Yeah, you know boy, what happened there? He had a shocker. overwhelmed that he's getting booed and oh, well, getting, yeah, the, getting the jeers of the true, crowd. True, but he came Jeez. over like you two boys were all over going, oh, what a great get. Quite it Collingwood. was a good get. And I kept saying, I'm with you. No, he's, a, he's just a small four that's average. Not, hasn't got much, mm. many more tricks to it. No, I agree with that. He's no, no he's no Bobby Hill. He's no, no, no. Charlie Cameron. No. He's, yeah, but I think they need a. F- we'll talk about Charlie Cameron. I, I think yeah. they needed a. a a different type of forward, Collingwood, you know what I mean? Because they got Bobby Hill. They know yeah, what he can do. Yeah, I know, but wouldn't you have kept... Anyway, but he's been you, poor. Hang on, wouldn't you, been... have, wouldn't you have kept Ginevan before him? I would have. Well, nah. yes. But look, to You're to me, Ginevan's not better than Shields. No, no, to his me, time's was, over. To me, it doesn't matter. same, yes. same. Yeah. You just sent a bloke to another club and brought in the same thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. to answer your question, yeah. What, what difference would it have made? Yeah, That's but right. Ginevan was playing up a bit. Yeah, there was off-field Yeah, they just had enough of him. Let's get to Saturday, Bluntstone Arena. North Melbourne seven six forty eight, Port Adelaide sixteen eleven one hundred and seven. <laughs> same 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 not, same, but not different different. Not different different. Same same. Yep. Seven six forty eight. Well, what does that tell you? Well, well, thirteen shots a goal. You're not going to win. I'm not going to have a crack local Nick, footy. I'm not going to have a crack at Nick Larky personally, but I'll tell you, some of the dis- the uh, supply to him is horrendous to say mm. the least. Horrendous. And yep. the VFL today got whacked, so there's nothing else. 
Yeah, yeah they've really else. fallen in a hole too, the VFL. Nothing, that's Sellers. He looked terrible. But this Mark is McClure. the thing, right? Yeah, Mark McClure. There, and the people go, oh, you know, North Melbourne, they've got three picks in the mid-season. So what? Right, dr- th- mid-season um, draft. Draft, yeah. But what are they going to do? Get another Toby Pink. I'm sorry. Yeah, I agree with you. I'm sorry. Toby yeah. Pink, I've seen enough. That's enough. See you later. You've had a good crack at AFL. Back to the sample, mate. I agree. He's no good. Tyler Sellers, he played sample. No Stop good. it. No good. No good. He, they're trying to cut corners. Oh, he he might come right. good. He might come good. Yep. He might come good. Let me tell they're you, just, mate. They're you just know, amateur yesterday, footballers. Ports were going at, oh, I'm not, and I'm not exaggerating this. Anyone that watched that will go, yeah, you're right. 70%. Yeah, seventy percent. And I thought they, Buddy's did a hammy in the first two seconds. Yeah, I know. They could have won. Well, they won by ten goals. They could have won by fifteen goals. No problem. Yeah. No problem. Yeah. They just go. We've got a five day break. They're playing Carlton. Let's, yeah. let's not. Oh, let's absolutely. Not. And you know, people say they don't take your foot off. I didn't say they took the foot off. They just chipped it around. They just go, yeah, here, North kick a goal. Who cares? Mm. Seven six forty eight. That was Port Adelaide scoring midway through the second quarter. From yeah. Wrong. So where to? Oh, it's a mess. I don't know. It's a bigger no, mess no than mess, anyone so. could ever even. Think yeah, and I'm sick of people going. Oh, how can you go to town on them? Be patient. Yeah. Look at Hawthorne. That's exactly what I was going to say. Look at Hawthorne. They're going to win six games, so they'll get one win six, a month. Seven games, whatever. But Doesn't they matter. get their one win a month. But they don't get whacked often. No, and they're competitive. So, so, so just on Hawthorne, when I said to you a few weeks ago about Clarkson, he doesn't show any emotion, doesn't get angry, right? Sam Mitchell said about four or five weeks ago. He said, "Bring your mouth guards to training." He had enough. He was yeah, sick of being nice, right? Yeah, the North game. Right. And they've won three out of four. Yep. He's, had, he's seen enough. When's Clarkson going to go? Defend- yeah, go I, I'm just saying. It right, might not make a difference, but when is he going to go? Enough's enough, boys. 6 a.m., you're running the marathon. I, don't oh, care. I agree. I don't it's care if there's true. 100 injuries. Like, create, so, create some, like, um, you know, just, just some standards there. They yeah, go, this, yeah, this, yeah, is, yeah. this isn't good he's enough. On, who's going to create it other no, than Clarkson? The coach. That's it. He was on the boundary line again yesterday. But, like, there was a couple of times where he turned bits of play and if you train him, he's turned around, he's been a little Half bit hearted. like... Half-hearted. You know, well, you can tell it was a bit cut. You know, like, fuck, like, what are they doing? You know what I mean? But, mate, he's right. I'll be like, enough, enough, boys. Yeah, enough. This football club is not, uh, it's not in a hole. It's beyond a hole, mate. Do you know what we've won? I read this one today. Out One out of 32. One out of 32. Jeez. They won't... One thing, people, I keep saying they won't win a game. And We've you're been right. Saying no, that. no, I'm coming I'm to that. sick of hearing it's people go, closer. oh, they'll tin us again. I did say no, that. they won't. They won't. Yeah. When right. you're kicking 7, 6, 48 every week, you're not winning yeah. a game of and football. And do you remember Hobart used to be the... Fortress. Yeah, North, mate. You won't beat North Also, and like, this is in no defence to North, but I look at Hawthorne and I look at today and they've got Gunston and they've got Sicily and they've got... Aim on. Season campaign. Yeah, and you look at West Coast, okay, they're getting a bit of a touch-up today, this weekend, but they've got Yo, they've got McGovern. Mm. Yeah. What's North got? Uh, what's his name in the midfield? Um, I love him. And they've got Dom Kelly. Sheed. Kelly. Dom Sheed. Dom Sheed kicked the winning goal in the grand final five yeah. years ago. Kelly. Kelly. North don't have any of that ilk. Zero. Let me tell you right now. So that's why they're not winning games. That's why they've got no leadership. They've got nothing. I'll tell you right now in that midfield, like, Elder you was all right. He had 35 touches yesterday, but he was actually, he was good. All right? I must say that. But let me tell you, mate, you're Luke McDonald's of the world. Yeah, I know. Oh, yeah. Get out. Get <laughs> get out. Get out. Jay Archer. You're not your old man's, I can't even say it on. Bootlace. I could say <laughs> something Bootlace. else. Bootlace. I could say something else, but I won't. <laughs> I want to. No good. Before we move on from this game, mm-hmm. both your opinions on. Because we need to. Jason Horn, Francis's carry on. Like, no, stop see, it, mate. Just stop, stop, stop it. being a wanker. Yeah, he's pointing okay. to the scoreboard. I, 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 stop yeah, he's it. pointing to the scoreboard at Combat. Now, Combat's probably looking at him and going, Who mate, are you? you were, yeah. You were here for three minutes, mate. Are you that hurt yeah. by your experience at North? Just give it up, mate. Yeah. Well, you were here for three minutes. Just give it Carrying up. Carrying on. Play your footy. Scoreboard, yeah. Going up to Combat when he took the mark. That's right. Like, if Combat wanted to, would have put him into Kingdom well, Combat yeah. and smack him But it's not as if Horn Francis was there for six years, won a yeah. best and fairest and yeah. the brown line was a, yeah. you know, he was I there for three Minutes. Yeah, he played well yesterday. Hey, who touchdowns. are you? Yeah, you won't even be on the board in North's history. You'll be in the stat. You know, stats has played seventeen games of footy. Do you agree? I agree with. You. I thought you were gonna. I was gonna have a crack at that. And I thought, oh, but you know what? Good play. All the rest of it. No, he was best on ground by miles. Good. I don't have best on ground. He's probably well, second best. Yeah, but anyway. But the, anyway, I agree. The time. But I'm serious. Like, oh, I can't act that. That's ridiculous. What yep. you did. Let's get on to Marvel Stadium. Carlton 15, 12, 102. Defeated Gold Coast 11, 7, 73. Standard five goal win. Was. They didn't put. 
Jeez. Gold Coast did not get within a bull's, bull's roar. roar. <laughs> a bull's roar. I'm sick of God. You ever can't... heard a bull roar? Yeah, yeah. It's pretty loud. I, I can't stand Gold Coast. I, I despise them. Really? Get out of the competition. Piss get off. Get out. Out. Seriously? Get out. So uh-huh. if, they, if they were out, what about us? Yeah. At least they win games. I'd love to win you, final you know, in Northern you know, if, you know if the AFL invested the money in North Melbourne, they invested in this rabble, right? North would be on top of the ladder. Probably. <laughs> they invest hundreds it's of millions true. of dollars He's right in there. these rabbles, right? As soon as they get on the plane, it's over. Forget He's it. Right. He's yeah, right. no, it's I'll give him that. over. So what, are you expecting Gold Coast to knock over Carlton and then you'd be on a different tune? Oh, no, you'd be having a crack at Carlton. That's right, yeah, 100%. Now. But never going to happen. More importantly, don't worry about them, Carlton. Play the, your words, play against play school, mate. <laughs> this is rubbish. This is a rubbish game. Really? They should have just showed up, bounced the ball and go, it's over. This is a score, five goal win. Go home. Yeah, he's okay. We said that. My, my, yeah. my question to you, are you happy with that? Are you content? It means nothing. It's four points. This week, next week, round Quite 12, it will yep. tell the tale on Carlton. Yeah. This is rubbish. Yeah, they're, they're, play, they're playing. Tell the tale on two big flat track bullies. The two big flat track bullies next week. That both oh, need Port's to win. a bigger flat track bully than them. I think you're right. No doubt. Yeah, I think you're right. Maybe. If this game was in Melbourne, I'd give – it's a, it's a Monty Carlton. Over there, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, so, so it says nothing about Carlton. What else you got on us for Carlton? Nothing. I don't know. Just, uh, I, I, I was so bored watching that game, I'm telling you. How that. did my boy play? Oh, he's <laughs> got subbed out again. See, what did he kick one goal? Oh, actually, he's got nothing yeah, coming kicked... up to put pressure on him, though. Correct. Oh, Mot-Lop. He's... Nah. Like, Motlop's Mot-Lop Mot-Lop injured still. Yeah, yeah, but anyway, I, I will say, I'll give you this. Jizo play well without 27. Pitnet, Pitnet. Yeah, I won't say his name. Pitnet. I, I copped a bit of a hiding in the comments of the Carlton Club corner about, about Pitnet. Yeah, I wanted to give. How him dare a you too, not say his? How dare you not say his, his surname? I can say whatever I want. <laughs> <laughs> um, but geez, you won't the, say it, really. The, the conning was best on ground, but it works. And it, free, and it freed up the forward line. How did like Charlie said, and Harry play? Harry pre ordinary. Charlie kicked four. Average. He kicked four in the second half. On Sam Collins. Yeah, that's him a good result. Mm. Same kind of decent. Yeah, but I agree. But they look okay. okay. Remember Mighty Mouse? Mm. No, not Mighty Mouse. Fearless Fly. Yeah. So he'd walk out and he was useless. As soon as you put the specs on, strong. That, <laughs> that's flat track bully for you. That's Gold Coast, right? Who as was soon it? John, they, John Speck. Who's that one who used to wear the glasses? No, no, no. Always careful not to reveal his true identity. Fearless Fly hides from view as he removes his glasses, which generate millions of megatons of energy through the sensitive muscles in his head. And becomes a meek, mild, passive little fly. But as soon as they get on the Spinks. plane, Gold Coast, they're like they're useless. They, they've got no glasses. Yeah, there. but they're not. They're oh, not I'm on, sick of it. Own with that. Many interstate. All yeah, I know, but, but them of all, like they just keep sprick. Oh, you know, we're going to play finals this year. You're not. I'll no take him seriously. It's the King Cup next week or the week after, isn't it? Gold uh, Coast and Kilda. I, want, the King's I, I Brothers promise Cup. you, I'm not watching that one. No I chance. Promise That's what's on King's birthday weekend. You can watch it. Really? You can I be the so. correspondent on that one. I'm working it, so I'll be the correspondent. Well, oh, we won't watch it. Enjoy. I, I might go live. I'll do my own live stream. Do for a that live game. stream on your own. The Twilight game, we wasted too much time because we should be talking about this. GM HBA Stadium, Geelong 11874, GWS 111278. Vito, explain to our viewers. The, pro, the how this game panned out. Geelong kicked the first uh, six. Nah, that right? not no, that not many. Six, nah. Four? Nah, nah, three or four, maybe. It was about four to four? one. At one then point. they got twenty points up. Giants went bang, bang, bang. Yeah. Got like twenty points up. Then Cats got him and got at in front of him again by a little bit. Mate, Toby Green's goal, mate. What a goal on the on the just about they fantastic they finally, they goal. Found but what him. about the defensive mark? Oh, how good was that? Aaliyah. What's his name? Aaliyah. I don't know. Leak, Aaliyah. Aaliyah. Leak. Is he, is Leak, he, is he Leak, related? Aaliyah. I don't know. He, don't, he might be. He well, is every think, Smith related? That's a good point. <laughs> so I don't know. I actually <laughs> no, don't know. No, no, I'm serious. No, you, don't, you, don't, you don't know. Oh, I don't know. I don't Did know. You see that related. last mark he took? That's just the last courage. Match because winning mark. He yeah. drops that. That ball drops yeah. and anything happens. He, he took two in the last two incredible minutes. Incredible marks. Yeah. You want to talk about Leo Barry? I know not in the same York. Yeah, but you know what I, I'm I understand, to say? yeah. Well, incredible. save the game. It did Absolutely. save the game. The ball spills. But Toby's goal on magnificent time. Magnificent. Brilliant. Brilliant. He played all right too. I was going to say, he was probably their best player. They needed that win. They really needed it. Didn't they? They did. They both. Either of them needed it. I'm actually going to look into the camera. Not at you. (laughs) He'll owe me an apology. Will not play finals football Geelong. I said it from the start of the year and I got laughed at. Yeah. I'm. Yeah. You're starting to come to me? Yeah, yeah, they're slipping out. No, I I can't. Top four, he said. 
I said top, top four. four. He didn't say after, finals. He just said he said top, top four. four. Yeah, and I said we're not Bay finals. Yeah, they were looking know. good after round seven, weren't they? Well, oh, yeah, you're yeah. looking. Who they got? Oh, well, so they got Richmond next week. So at the corridor, so it doesn't. We'll talk about that. GWS amazingly have won four in a row. Yeah, yeah, yeah Mark, they have. Yeah. Correct. Four in a row. It's amazing. That's mind-blowing when you it think is. about it. It so is. Wh- so why can they do it and Gold Coast can't? Why can GWS? They put them in the same ballpark, mate. Yeah, it's, no, why? it's skill set. Hang on, hang on a minute. Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah. But just match winners that they haven't got. Yeah. GWS so are miles ahead of Gold Toby Coast. Toby Green. Yeah, I know. Tom Green's better than any Gold Coast midfielder. No, but I my agree. point is, why why can't Gold Coast well, do it? They, they'll... One year apart, I know, I know, into but the I just think how they've evolved and GWS. You know what it's like if you're in the window, you mm. attack the draft, and you well, you don't attack the draft, but mm. you know you attack good footballers that are going to take your team to the next level. Gold Coast haven't had that opportunity. Oh, they've had more of an they've opportunity. Wasted they've draft. wasted their draft. They've wasted their draft. They've wasted their draft. Haven't played finals yet. That's yeah. they not played finals. No, no, they, they haven't. haven't. Well, that's, come on, they haven't. Oh, yeah, hey, I'm staggered by that. No man. more in that game. No more. It was a beauty. No more. Saturday, dream time at the G, Richmond 10, 14, 74, Essendon 12, 14, 86. I had a mate that texted me and said, and he's never even met you. He goes, mm. Vito is right. He thinks he knows you. <laughs> Vito is right. Um, what am I right That's about? That's all it was. It was just Vito is right. It was like- My call? I nearly pulled yeah. it off. And I go, Who, what are you talking about? He goes, Richmond. They were four points behind at one stage, and I nearly pulled it off. But all due respect, Essendon did what they had to do. I can't say I watched that whole game. Because I was on another channel watching another watching sport. Another sport. 3 1, I believe. Disgraceful. 1 0 up another, at one stage. Uh, with three minutes to go. Yeah. Anyway. What a far. What happened there? Uh, you might have to talk to him about that. Off camera. Well, we can have a little segment at the end. Maybe. If you want to do a little review. But yeah, Richmond. Hang on. Do you want to say the score? I did. did. Did you? Yep. You did say. Okay. We'll just start, say Richmond, and I'll cut it out. Okay. Go. Anyway, Richmond. Oh, very good. I mean, two goal loss to Essendon after Essendon's been flying, and I mean, second on the ladder, mm. you can't. But Richmond's unknowns did okay. I thought, like you know, when I say unknowns, guys have played a handful of games. I don't reckon but they Dusty, were ever going to lose. Oh, Dusty. Dusty was sensational. How yeah. good was he? Wound back the clock. Yeah, no doubt. Every time, because I worked that game, and every time he went near it, you could just feel the crowd yeah. lift rising. Every time he went so near it, it was a Richmond home game, so there would yeah, have been quite helps. a few. Yeah. But I thought, like, Bolton was good. Oh, yeah. He, he was, was up good. and about. Bolter was good. Bolter yeah, was Bolton, good. He's, he's a good football Cumberland player. blew an easy goal there. That put a, Cumberland put a, is... He's an ugly footballer. He kicked footballer. five on, not quite debut, but... Yeah. What has he done since? But he had a good chance. I don't know if you know what I'm talking about. Yeah. There's a couple of minutes, mate. That would have been, I think that would have put him in front, if I'm not wrong. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. close, yeah. I thought Mackay got beaten. Mackay yeah, McKay. Yeah. I thought yeah. Goldstein got beat. Yeah. Well, Goldstein got beat last got week. Got beat last week, yeah. too. Yeah, his time's up, isn't it? Let's be so honest. Stringer early was good, and he was, then obviously Jaden Short tightened up on really him. Really good. Stringer started well. He was great in the first half. He, did, yeah. he was good he was, first half. If they turned up on him in the first half, it would have yeah, been, could have been a different it, yeah. result. Look, they, they worked all the way through the night, didn't they? They yeah. didn't give up. They didn't no. give up. Essendon did what they had to do. Yeah, exactly. And I, got the I don't points. think they were going to lose. Well, I don't know about that. I reckon they were pushed to to. Yeah, that's what we know, but. But they won, right? They so did. It's one of those ones where, you know, a good side plays a bottom side and the bottom side just goes, today's our, you know, yeah, yeah. we're going to go 200 miles an hour. And this is like, was it the right. dream time thing as well? No, nah, yeah. saying yeah. that, though, you've got a point because at one stage in the last quarter, it's only a kick in uh, yeah, under a it? kick. Mm. So you can't say that. You're right. Because if Richmond get a, a five, next. ten minute spurt and kick two goals, they're, in, they're just about to lose the game. No, That's no, right. I understand that. But the better team won is yeah, what I'm saying. Yeah, like, yeah. They always, I thought they were always just yeah. going to win because yeah, under, they're yeah. better. I, know, wouldn't say better. It's under, I wouldn't say it was under control, though. No, not all night. And I reckon... Um, Really coming back into that side, that's just going to shore him up. Yeah, yeah. Oh, for sure. Like, the goal as well. The, kicked a goal, 27 touches, won the medal. He's going to be really handy because that's what they've – they haven't missed it, but it's just another It allows attribute. Redmond to run a bit. It more. allows Redmond to yeah. run and really like – So, this. question, do they finish top four from here? Um, Essendon? Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, I, I can't say not. in the bank. Yeah. They play Gold Coast next week, so – There's a win. On your theory, so, I think they do. So, is, so are they – where are they playing Gold Coast? In – up there, okay. so it'll be a tight tussle. Yeah, not in Northern Territory though. No. So <laughs> Essendon wouldn't go to Northern Territory. Just no. quickly, no way. No. So just, yeah, that's what I'm trying no, to say. No, you wouldn't send them up there. Collingwood, nor Carlton. No nor, way. Yeah. Anyway, oh, I think your question you were going to say about Essendon. Oh, I know top four, but what's the what's the plus for them this year? They need to win a final. They've got to win a final. Twenty years without winning one. That's right. They've that's got to win a final, and they've got, mm. they'll get two chances at it. Oh. You have to win one. 
you know, every year you get a team. I'm saying that though. If they make, so, if they win the first so, final, they could make the grand final. So you well, say that they have to win a final, but do they? Like, isn't that progress that's finishing good, top four? That's a very like, good call. Honestly? Yeah, that's a good like call. putting yourself in that position. I know there's a big monkey on the back. Finish uh, on top four and then losing straight, straight sets. No, no, it's nah, not ideal, but... I can't buy that. No, no. But they don't have to win the final to say, geez, that's a good season. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they I mean, do. Nah, I thought about it for a second, but yeah, I think they've got to win one. Okay, fair enough. Well, could you imagine they win that straight sets like Vito said? So 20 years they win, make, get, get to top four. Because for years they've been finishing ninth, tenth. Yeah. Get to top four, bundle out straight sets. Just so it depends how they get bundled out too. They get bundled out easily in straight sets and it's back to square one again. It is. But but who cares unless you win the premiership? Who cares? Oh, no, nah, of course Let's you care. Let's be honest. I'd rather no, get the premiership. But not every team can win the. Yeah. No, nah, I would not. Nah, That's I right. I would. No, I would. Nah, of course. I would. Nah. This afternoon, Marvel Stadium, Hawthorne 15 10 100, defeat of Brisbane 10 15 75. Do you want to. Would you. Can you it up? No, do you want to apologise oh. to me? No, I said Hawthorne would win. Good call. He said, don't be silly. Yeah, yeah it's true. Yep. I was. Uh, I was fonts. Are we fonts? Uh, Brisbane done? You're done. Go on. It's over. I thought that was done anyway, but I thought they'd win that game. Staggered they lost today. I'm not. They've won four games this year. I looked at the ladder and gone, no, they've won four games. Yeah. They're shocking. It's over. So and Chris Fagan, it's over. I yeah, reckon it's he's over. He's run. Yeah, they all have. So you need, what, 13 to play finals, yeah, you reckon? 12, it's over. 13. So they're four and seven now? Yeah. They're, so they're going to win... Eight out of the next ten. No, twelve. They're not. No, next 12. They're not. They're not eighting, They're not winning eight. They've got to win 12. eight or nine of the next twelve. Yeah, impossible. And not. And they've lost quite a few at home already. Yeah, they're not. No chance. Good night, Jack. They're done. So I worked this game, and my first reaction during the course all day was Brisbane's pressure just was non-existent. Yeah. What about all those pressure? What about their work? Well, that's what, what I mean. Work rate and pressure was just poles apart today. Oh, I didn't like. I didn't watch the whole thing, but. Mo- Hawthorne's movement of the was football was incredible. Very good. Very you nice. Know, Hawthorne Very were getting the footy into open 50, into their forward 50 half, and it was one on one contests. Every time Brisbane went, got it forward, mate, it was, it was like 13 on 13. I'll just say one thing. What a revelation, mate. Mabio up forward. Great kick. Emmett bubbled all good. Goals. Emmett. Mabio. Kicked a couple of good now, goals. Th- th- there's your solution, North Melbourne. Get a young, smart coach. They had Reece Short. Got, I don't know what happened there. Please. Who they he, have after Reece? He gave up. Okay. The accountant. The accountant, right? <laughs> An old, older club because Brisbane did what they did, right? Yeah, but we're and going they, on to Northy. No, no, I'm just saying. Then no, they're making a the point. Then they've just got they've got Clarkson. Look at Sam Mitchell. Yeah, he's making a point. They, oh. they haven't got a great list, Hawthorne. They, they've no, got good no. game plan, good players, good players, right? Everyone's got good players. Oh, That's how you up. play. Yeah, but they play for him. Yeah, he said that 100%. too. He's and you said that about Collingwood last year in the run home. Yeah. Remember, he was saying McRae. They, they play, play for there's each this, other. There's this connection between player and coach. Yeah, hundred percent. And the Hawthorns and got North, anything. And North are like that because, like, they got. You know, I'm going to name some names like McKenzie and McDonald. Yeah, they just players. Yeah, you know, all these like yeah, um, I agree. Ward, Hardwick. Oh, who's the other one? Number forty with a mustache. Mitchell. Mitchell, yeah, yeah. You know, like so, they've got all these Mitchell unknown and... blokes, but just tying it together. They, they, just they made all of them look second. They made Brisbane look second. The right, yeah. halfback, flat, Weddle. Weddle's a good player. Really Very good, good player. Ballers. But I understand, And they yeah. just split them open today. So where's they Brisbane did. at? Where is Brisbane at? No, it's, it's this over. This is my point, what it's I want over. to say to you. And what I mentioned him before when we talked about Carlton Small Forwards. You got Charlie. Charlie Cameron, I'm sorry. You can sing all the songs you like. Anyway. And I've said this. He's overrated for me. He's the biggest downhill skier I've ever seen. He will kick goals against crap sides. He'll run around against North and St Kilda and whatever. Yep. Yeah, he's a dead right. skier. Was he important in that preliminary final last year? Okay, maybe. Yeah, last Perhaps. year. I'm not singling out. No, not last year. But I'm just year. saying, as, yeah. a, as a general... Like, gen- yeah. Do you agree? He just gets the support up field, further upfield he's not getting. Nah. They look disinterested. Mate, it's all going to the yeah, it, I, I agree yeah. with you. Zorka was laughing today at a few decisions. Had like, no interest. Giggling. Yeah. Do you think it's because your theory... Five years, mate. Five years at the top. They don't know it's getting doing tiring. It's, uh, they, it's, yeah. Let me ask you a question, boys. How's Richmond gone after five years? They won their flags. Well, they, they were up That's for right. five, five Different years. Different years, they've won three flags. So yeah. No, probably. but they were up for five years. It doesn't matter what they did, but they were up, right? Up the top. Now they're... Yeah. yeah at least things change. Things oh, change. They fall on their own sword. They had yeah. a chance through COVID. Yeah. They were hosting the grand final. Yeah. So, yeah. No, they didn't. But they had a preliminary that they didn't get. Yeah, they but they hosted home. The, the grand final was in Brisbane. The yeah. 2020, they didn't even make but it. But they had, a, they had they had every golden game opportunity. No, okay. Look, and, and you're right. And Danaher, they just... Danaher's Dana Dana the only shining light, I thought. Hey, what about Hibble didn't play, did he? No, he didn't play. What's wrong with him? Don't know. He got didn't one play. week suspension. Oh, yeah, he got suspended. Did he? I didn't know that. Yeah. Yep. He's uh, smacking his own team, Matt McCluggies. He probably nah. <laughs> deserved and, a whack for it. And as for, <laughs> see, this is why I giggle at Brisbane, right? If they think 
You all right? Yeah, sorry about that. It's Speaking. Right. <laughs> when I speak, you, your mouth Come on, goes shut. Come on, let's go, That's quickly. That's the Miz from wrestling. Anyway. Do you know what this means? Do you know what this means? When my hand goes up, your mouth goes shut. Um, Kyle Lohman. That little smart ass. Do you want to talk, on, you want, start talking about him? Smart ass. Oh, yes. Do you want to talk about Charlie Cameron, flat track bullies? Oh, oh he's, Kyle a biggest, Lohman, he's the biggest. Yep. What Running around do? with his finger yeah. in the air against North and oh, against what, other sides. What did he do? What he, he kicked two goals today and he's got oh, he thought he was gonna win the game for him. Relax, mate. Relax, buddy. Relax. I totally agree with him. Relax, buddy. You got a long, Relax. long way to you, go. You might be a good player, but just calm it down a bit. Yeah, yeah, I'm totally with him. The Twilight game, the Snorefest, Melbourne 14 16, 100 defeated St Kilda 9 8 62. And that's actually a high scoring game for St Kilda Melbourne. Yeah, 160. Melbourne points. kicked 100. Melbourne had 30 shots for goal, though. They did. Oh, look, who did the damage there take? Because I, like, I didn't see a lot of that. Stephen May kicked the goal. Oh, dear. That mm. says it all. Yeah. Well, who, who was it? Petrarca, the usual. Oh, Salem was Salem was good. Fritch was good again yeah, up yeah. forward. How was Petrarca and Oliver? Yeah, that was Oh, Oliver was. Better than Petrarca. Better, yeah. Eight. Gone was good, but... Gone was the was best, I thought. Uh, the floor is yours. We're St. Kilda. No, no, I'm being serious. We Where are the they? floor every week with St. Kilda. This so they kicked 62, calm. right? Do you reckon that's a good score? Record score for Shock. Them. Yeah. <laughs> you know they kicked three, the last three goals of the game? When no, it was over. Yeah, yeah I swear did. to God. 6 8 44 they were. Yeah. Yeah. Worth. It was six goals. Yeah. It was 10-10 to 5-5 five, five at one stage. Out. Piss off, Ross Lyon. Get out. You know, how many pre- – can I ask you a question? Thank you for not eating 100 nuggets, I'd be saying. Yeah. It was never going to happen. Uh, how many on, premierships has Brisbane won, uh, has St Kilda won? How many premierships? Well, once in 1966. And how long has the league been going? 120 Eight, years? 1897. Well, 1897. So 120 years. Well, a- 120. So what's that tell you about that club who now have given full ownership to, to one bloke? He runs that club. He does. It's He's destroyed that football club again. They're 10 years away. How from, can you go back and get him? They're yeah. 10 years away from we winning said that a at final. The time. Yeah, he's he's horrendous. There was, Brett yeah. Ratton was the best option. Yeah. No doubt. He was 100%. great. He was great for St. Kilda. playing different footy. Everyone then. loved him. He was a character. Like, this clown, he's got no... He, he, the game's passed him by 10 years ago. Jeez, if he if he gets a hold of it, he's going to say, you're a you're smart, you're you're smart, smart Andrew. Hey, we did that last week, mate. You don't have to keep re That's what you do. No, yeah. I'm sick. I'm sick of Ross. I can't stand St. Kilda. It's just an incredible co- tragedy. Not tragedy, but like, it's not a tragedy. One flag and that's it. Mate. But forget about that. Okay, you're right. Forget it's... about that. Surely as the weeks go by, this has been serious. Surely as the weeks go by, you look at it and go, this is not working. Forget about You would think so. You look and go, okay, we need to play more attacking. We need to do this, this, I don't know, whatever they want to do, but we need to score. Yep, you would think so. But why hasn't he changed that? Because he's a stubborn mule. Oh, well his then, philosophy is defence first, yeah. and he goes which by his coaching tw- philosophy. Which is 20 years old. But that's what it is. Okay. Well, what's wrong? It's just what it is. I go to the post office the other day so, so, to pick up a package, and mm. four people in front of me have bills that they are paying mm. over the counter. Mm. That's it's old. Just, yeah. That's okay. old school. It's just right. people. But, but tell me something. If you're a coach, <laughs> if you're a coach, right, and you just look at stats, right? Because a lot of coaches look at stats and analytics and stuff, right? If you look at the last 10 grand finals, which I did bring up, right? You did. Eight out of the 10 have kicked 100 points to win a grand final. No, you can't even play finals with scores like that. No, you no. can't. Anyway. But, but no. you understand what I'm yeah. saying? Like, oh, no. You know, you can be stubborn in defense and whatever. What was but the other 100 nugget question was I was going to... Fremantle. Nug- to make the finals? Yeah, they won't yeah, make no it. IP, They're no in the eight. That's okay. Not until the end of the season. We're, I'm riding this from here on end. Mm. I'm going hard on Freo. To do what? To make the eight. No chance. I don't think they will. Just, no chance. But you are eating 100 nuggets if they make it. Yeah. Because we know the Kilda nuggets are gone. Oh, they're gone. I'm going to put another one. Gold Coast, 100 nuggets. Will not play finals. No, I agree with that. Yeah. No, it's not. They're no, they're no chance, though. Frio's in the eight. Right. Anyway. 100 nuggets, snorf win a game? Nah, I can't. I'm not going there. Now, there's a tantalizing <laughs> going there. prospect. Nah. And the last game of the round, Sunday, 4.40, Adelaide Oval. Adelaide Crows, 21-11-137. Defeated West Coast Eagles, 5-8-38 by 99 points. <laughs> and no Rankin. He didn't play. And someone didn't else did that, I think. I'm not sure who else was there, but Rankin didn't play. And Shoal got 34 possessions. When he's running around getting 34 possessions, there's a problem. There's a problem. And Chase Jones kicked three or four? Chase Jones kicked three. 
it's and a host of players. Disgusting by West Coast. It's it's See, poor. See, you're it? all you say. They haven't won a game on the road, have they? No. Nah, What's that? You know, everyone's going, oh, West Coast singing their praises no, and all the rest of it. No, no, no. That's no, rubbish. No. So it's too obvious, and it's probably really naive, but it's too obvious for me that Simpson and Co. They just give up on interstate trips. Yeah, they do. I reckon they Jeez. do. And they bust their mm. nut to win at home. Well, well, to keep to keep the entourage on their side. Well, how obvious yeah. does it look? Yeah. Do you know why? Because last year there was the protests about West Coast Eagles supporters forfeiting games and not boycotting, not forfeiting, boycotting, yeah. boycotting the first quarters of games. Why? Because the Eagles played like six in a row and didn't score. In yeah, the they didn't score quarter. in the first. And they were boycotting yeah. games at, at Perth Stadium last year. And then what? Turning late, up, yeah, turning up late. And like, maybe so make a point of maybe, yeah, not turning up. And maybe they're thinking. We need to put our eggs yeah, in. We like, can't win a game on the road. How, how did Harley go to many touches? Harley was ruggled. very quiet today. Very quiet. Give your stats up, Ange, for a second. Just one you want Harley's stats? Know, yeah, it's really Harley's stats. I'm just curious. I'm not having a go at Keep him. Keep chatting away while I get Harley's stats up. I'll have a go at him. You've got to play good everywhere to be a good player. Not I agree. Just, not just in Perth. But saying that, though, he's only been around for you know five minutes. That's okay, but he's the number one pick. They talk about him like he's, oh, no, he, he's, a, he's a bit cocky. I agree with Jeez. you. 14 possessions, eight kicks, six handballs, and a goal. But he was quiet overall. He was quiet. He didn't like he had yeah. no impact. Like Zero had. impact. Yeah, I think, like you said before, we spoke. He's coming back to earth. He's going to he come is. back to earth. It's disgusting, West Coast. Like I hate what they're doing. That's I bad. Hate that no, doing that, that is bad. Yeah, my theory could be yeah somewhat because you know they're half a chance when they play home mm. to win games of footy. It's interesting their next time game, but anyway, we'll talk be about that in another week. Absolutely. Well, there you have it, our review of round 11 in the books. Let us know in the comments if your team won, and we'll see you in the next one.